So in closing, and I know I got to keep this short, otherwise Jim will get the hook. He'll try. So in closing, although Americans might be losing sight of their godly principles, okay, that doesn't mean that we don't, as the American people, don't have the ability to still be one nation under God. Okay? As long as we, the people, the American people, continue to share our godly principles with others. And there will be times, many times, when those principles or those lessons that you're sharing will fall on deaf ears. Or even worse, people just won't give a shit and they won't listen. Quite frankly, we're kind of at that crossroad again in our nation's history, aren't we? Where it just seems like, regardless of who's president, regardless of who's running, regardless of this scandal or that scandal, there's no excuse to treat each other poorly. We're kind of at that crossroad. So, with that, I say to you, especially exchangeites, because I know your passion, I know your call of creed, I know everything about you guys, because I'm one of you. Keep learning, keep sharing, keep growing, and keep getting out there to prop people up. Because as you prop others up, and as you lightly scratch that surface, and you find a way to interject yourself and help them, you will be propping up that person, and you'll be doing it in a most godly way. And as a result, you will honor our nation's God. And I'll say it one more time. You will honor our nation's God. Okay? He's a God that created us all differently, loves our differences, loves our independence, loves the color of our skins, regardless of what they are. And he's a God that loves us all equally and wants to see us polish on each other so that we can all shine as one people. Shine as one people, one nation under God. And with that, I say thank you so much for your time. Thank you so much.